Hey, how are you? It's great to see you again. It is Thursday. Thursday, almost uh, 20 minutes of seven. It's Rev Tim. <clears throat> I'm here. Grayson is here as well. He just walked over to see who I'm talking to and says, I would like to have my ear scratched. So uh, I will be doing that as well as uh, reading you a poem and talking to you. Um, so how you doing? Another day of waiting and expectation. And uh, I've been thinking a lot about a quote from uh, the great Unitarian abolitionist minister Theodore Parker. And it's a, it's a, it's a quote that was spoken and written at a time of great national upheaval in the 1860s. <clears throat> and then a hundred years later, this quote uh, was reframed by Martin Luther King Jr., Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., at another time of great social upheaval. And Theodore Parker said, I do not pretend to understand the moral universe. The arc is a long one. My eye reaches but little ways. I cannot calculate the curve and complete the figure by the experience of sight. I can divine it by conscience. And from what I see, I am sure it bends towards justice. That in the 1860s and then in the 1960s, Dr. Martin Luther King took that Unitarian quote and paraphrased it, saying, the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends towards justice. Today I have two poems, short poems, from Maya Angelou, and they seem just perfect for this moment in time, and I'm happy to share them with you. The first, Maya Angelou. History, despite its wrenching pain, cannot be unlived, but if faced with courage, need not be lived again. Lift up your eyes upon the day breaking for you. Give birth again to the dream. And a second short poem, Maya Angelou. And I think I'm going to use this one on Sunday in the service. We are weaned from our timidity in the flush of love's light. We dare be brave. And suddenly we see that love costs all we are and will ever be. Yet it is only love which sets us free. And as Cornell West reminds us, justice is what love looks like in public. And so as we wait so that each and every vote is counted, which, dear ones, is democracy. And as Unitarian Universalists, democracy is a key part of our religious values, our religious perspective. We believe in the use of the democratic process so that each voice can be heard. And so we wait as each voice is counted, each vote is counted. Justice is what love looks like in public. 
shall see you tomorrow.